All right, so highlight for today, as you guys know, in real time, what we were doing was tracking this long right in here, okay? And we were also seeing that this guy was offering at what turned out to be 89.75. So this gray line is an offer to exit this long position. So why is it important to know other people's position? Because it shows or gives a clue, obviously, as to what they have to do to exit that position. If you're long, you're a seller. You want to be a seller higher. That means it's a potentially profitable trade, but you're a seller nonetheless. So what's interesting is when this order gets filled up here, you're going to see this green long marking go away. Another interesting thing that happened is another pretty big long came in right here. All right. He happened to be offering at the same price as this guy. How do we know that? Because take a look right in here. This chart, as you guys know, is kind of magnifying this chart up in here. So if you look at this, you could see there were two orders on top of each other. And then you look at and see this guy and this guy are the two biggest longs essentially over the last 60 minutes. When this price gets filled, when the market goes up and buys this offer, you're going to see these two green on the vertical go bye-bye. But I want you to notice this one a tick lower. Do you see this one right in here? It's about half the size of the other ones. That remains after these 89.75s get bought. That remains, but these two go away. All right. Let's fast forward the tape. And boom, it goes away. Let's re let's back it up. So this right in here is also this offer. The reason why it's on this vertical is because it's showing the exit for the longs that we tagged. And so if we play it, boom. The reason why this one looks like it remained, it didn't remain. It just scaled because it was one tick below it. If I back it up, watch this. If I back it up, you're going to see it one tick lower. Watch this right in here. Click down. Right now, boom. It goes down a tick, and then it rescales, so it appears larger. But the point is, when that order, that offer was filled, the uh, long position we tagged went away because we no longer are interested of a long position that doesn't exist. We're interested in when longs and shorts come in. We're interested in where they're trying to get out. And we're interested when they go bye-bye. And we're also interested in how long it's been from an element of uh, time, how relevant. Is it the last two minutes, the last 60 minutes, or the last 15 hours? That's why these three verticals uh, are showing similar information. It looks like a lot of information. It's just different time frames, as I've often said. And so let's just look at it one more time and look at it from the standpoint of just look at this long grain. As soon as the 8975s get filled, his offer gets filled, you'll see it disappear. Gone. He's there. Take a look at it. And he's gone. That's the difference between the information you need to see and the information that you really have no chance of seeing anywhere else, not only because it's not available, people aren't able to filter appropriately getting to this point. They don't even think of why that would be an edge in the first place. So many people we were discussing get into this business and risking their money and really have no idea why price moves, and yet that's what they're trying to predict. They don't understand the importance and the value of other people's positions. They don't understand the importance of a scalpel, and yet they're surgeons who never went to med school. I'm pretty sure you wouldn't let them operate on you. And so that's the competition. You don't want to be with them, but you want to understand that's where a lot of the money gets donated into this business. Don't be part of that. You have to understand in the simplistic fashion, why price does what it does in order to give you the opportunity to predict it's going to rain before you're wet, to predict it's going to rain before you even see the clouds.
That's the only way you're going to create opportunity and any semblance of consistency is to be able to do that. And we started doing some video stuff. So on YouTube and even here in the room, people could put a face to the voice and just try to get the point across that keep it simple, stupid's an acronym, KISS, but it's an acronym for a reason. And most people don't keep it simple. Most people don't understand what the simple and the basic stuff is, so they skip over it. That's why I've always said the most important education and information that you can get in trading is what's basic. It's not basic to most of the rest of the world because it's skipped over. It is basic for those that have been in the business, that have succeeded in the business, and understand it. And that's what's missing for a lot of people is why price moves in the first place.